First Alert Weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. After dealing with the rain all week long, conditions are improving out there for us for your Friday and weekend. It'll still be a warm day out there. Cooler air will be moving in later on tonight, and that's where the breeze is going to come in. It is going to pick up as we go through today. Still looking for mostly sunny skies out there with highs in the upper 70s, even a few 80s on the map like Georgetown at 80, 79 in Marion Conway and Myrtle Beach, 78 in Bennettsville and Darlington. But the humidity stays nice and low for us, so it will feel a little more comfortable than what you saw this past week. We had a cold front roll through here early this morning, and as it pushes off to our east. Dry air moves in. That's what's lowering our humidity for us. The cooler air will really start to move in and settle in overnight and stick around for the weekend with this high pressure pushing eastward as well. That keeps the sunshine around, so it should shape up to be a beautiful weekend. The afternoons are going to be well, a little closer to seasonal averages right around the mid 70s, but the wake up conditions will be noticeably cooler mid to low 50s tomorrow morning upper 40s to low 50s on Sunday morning, but at least it's going to be a beauty of a weekend. If you are heading out to any of the high school football games this evening, be prepared for the chill that'll settle in as the game rolls on. Temps will be falling into the lower end of the 60s at games end. Then as we go to the weekend forecast for those college football games, big game USC, uh, I should say CCU versus Liberty. You have USC, Mississippi State and Clemson, Maryland. All the games look great. If you're heading up to Maryland, though, to watch that uh, Clemson game, it is going to be noticeably chillier as you go further to the north as well and as it is an evening game. So we are going to be looking for great weather across the east all weekend long. Low humidity levels across the Carolinas and for the Grand Strand, we're looking at mid 70s for highs Saturday and Sunday, mid to low 50s for your lows. We do warm back to the upper 70s for the beginning of next week before our next cold front, which will be a little more potent than this past cold front. Chances for rain out there for us late Tuesday through the day on Wednesday and much colder air coming in behind it. High of only 67 degrees on Thursday with sunshine, upper 40s for lows. That's for the Grand Strand inland areas, mid to upper 70s for today and through the weekend. 80 degrees on Monday and Tuesday. The cold front comes through and we drop to the mid 60s for highs on Thursday and wake up temps back to the middle and upper 40s. So noticeably cooler as we go towards the middle and end of next week. This weekend looks fantastic. Very pleasant in the afternoons. Not unseasonably cold in the mornings, but a little chillier than what we saw this past week with the upper 40s and low to mid 50s for those wake up numbers. So have yourself a wonderful Friday and a great safe weekend. Your latest news and weather updates are always on your website, carolinalive.com.